everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm sorry that my voice may sound a little odd. Um, I'm filming first thing in the morning. I just got ready. I haven't gone to work yet. Um, but I got the mail yesterday and I saw that I had my Ipsy for September and my BoxyCharm. So I've been so excited to jump into them. So I wanted to film this video first thing today because I want to know what's in these. So we're just going to go ahead and go through each of them and see what sort of goodies are in them. Starting off with Ipsy, the bag looks like this. It's cute. It's got little eyelashes on it. And inside we have a little card that tells you about each product. First thing I pull out is a brush. This is a tapered brush. It is from Luxie. It's a Luxie 140 Detailed Taper Blender. And it looks like this, so it's a little bit longer, but it comes, the bristles come to a point, so I imagine this would be a good brush for, I'd probably say, um, like, under eye concealer, um, like, blending all of that out would probably be a good function for this brush, so it's very soft, though. I really love all of the Luxie brushes that I've gotten through Ipsy. Next thing is the Super Fine Sea Salt Face Glow with Immortal Absolute. Um, it says blend pack it with one teaspoon of water, gently massage into face, and let rest five minutes, rinse, and pat dry. It's from Wild Honey Botanicals. It's interesting. I thought this was one of those, like, accidental salt packets that you sometimes get in boxes of shoes <laughs> or purses, but this is what it looks like. It's just a little one packet of salt, so that's kind of interesting. Next thing is the Cream Shop Double Cleanse 2-in-1 Facial Foam Daily Cleanser and Makeup Remover. It says it's got green tea and white lily rice water. And it is a brightening um, cleanser. It looks like this. Oh, there's another salt packet, so that was kind of nice that you get two to try. Um, you have a M Princess um, eyeshadow in Pretty Petal. This is a loose eyeshadow, so it's like a pigment. And I am always like super messy with these. Ah, so it's got a little sifter cover. Well, I'm not gonna open that because it'll take me 33 years. But um, it looks like it is a like pinky shade. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it looks pretty for sure. Maybe I'll have to do a tutorial with this. I have so many like loose eyeshadows from Ipsy that I've gotten in the past, and I really like them, but. I, they're just so messy, so, um, okay, fi final thing that I got is the Thank Me Later face primer that is mattifying from Elizabeth Mott, and it's a little travel size little primer. So yeah, that's everything in this month's Ipsy. The bag is really cute. I'd say those are some pretty cool products, so I'm pretty excited to try some of them out. On to BoxyCharm. All right, so the first thing that you have is the BoxyCharm card, and on the back they give you the two coupons each month. I'll put the codes below, but it looks like one of them is for Laura Geller. It's 30% off any order with new filler or filter first luminous foundation or concealer. So that's kind of cool. Um, and then the Dr. Brandt VIP offer. Visit us at Sephora.com and search Say I Love You to access a special ed limited edition microdermabrasion bundle offer. That's interesting. So instead of that one being a coupon, it's an offer from Sephora, so that's snazzy. Okay, well, I'm not going to open that because that'll spoil it, um, so I'm just going to jump right in. So the first thing I'm seeing is a Grande Lips Hydra Plump Liquid Lipstick. It says it's a semi-matte liquid lipstick, and this shade is Red Delicious. So let's take it out of the packaging. It says 97% comfortable to wear, 94% lips look naturally fuller, 94% didn't sting. Um, so that's kind of exciting. It says it's long wearing. That's pretty packaging. It's like gold and then they've got these little openings on both sides where the color is. It's really pretty. And then you've got like a traditional doe foot applicator. Hmm. It definitely has a scent to it. I don't know what that scent is. I almost wanted to say chocolate. But that's not what it is. It's like an almost chemically chocolatey smell. I don't know. That's kind of interesting, though. I'll have to try that. I'm excited. Uh, next thing is Girl Lactic. This is, oh, this is a Skin Glow Moonlight um, Blush Bronzer. Or Blush Highlight, actually. 
actually. Oh my goodness, these are cream. Oh my goodness, these are so pretty. Oh, that's so nice. Okay, so that's a cream blush and a highlight. Oh, this is so pretty. This has a perfumey smell to it, for sure. <laughs> I don't know why everything has a smell. That's interesting. But, wow, I'm very excited to use this. I don't have any... Like, the only cream blush that I've got right now is this Wet n Wild Stick, and honestly, it's not been my favorite so far, um, so I'm kind of excited to try this out, and it's so nice. Dang. Okay. That's that. I also have this Luscious Angel Eyes Eyeshadow Primer in base. So, this is what this looks like. It's just, it's got little angel wings and a heart on it. Um. I haven't ever heard of this brand before, so I'm excited to try this out. It says the shade is nude. I don't know if they're all nude or if that is actually um, tinted, so I'll have to see that. Oh, I was excited about these. So there are um, three makeup brushes here. I, I saw spoilers, so that's how I knew that these were potentially coming. Um, these are Alamar brushes, is that right? I don't know. Let me look. Yes. Alamar Cosmetics Brush Set. So it looks like you get a fluffy blending brush, a um, flat top um, eyeliner brush, and almost like a flat shader brush, kind of like a detailer brush. So these are on just first use, or, or first uh, feel. They're very soft, so and they're very high quality. They're green. I've never had green brushes. I kind of like it. So I'm excited to try those out. And final product. This is the Nightingale Pretty Vulgar Eyeshadow Palette. I'm very excited about this. This is what this looks like. You have some really nice um, blue and cooler tones in here, darker browns, um, a good mix of matte and shimmery shades. So I'm kind of excited to see how this performs. So I will definitely, definitely, definitely be doing a tutorial with this very, very soon. So yeah, that's everything that I got in my Ipsy for September and my BoxyCharm for September. I'd say I'm probably most excited about the palette and then the um, blush highlight duo. But honestly, I'm pretty excited about everything. There wasn't anything that I was just kind of like, meh, for. Um, I, I'd say the salt face packets are kind of different, but that doesn't mean that I'm not excited about them. It's just kind of different. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel before you leave just to stay up to date on all of my latest content. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.